Greetings, everyone, and welcome back to Equestrian War. I'm your host, Mr. Hellquill Lover. But right now, we are currently in a small little kerfuffle, as some would say, with the Carthinian Empire, in which we've done really well against the Republic of Nambuzia, but the Carthinian Pact, well, we're doing A-OK. -okay. We're currently doing resistance suppression. We've put down a lot of resistance. Ooh, actually, they were able to beat us right there. That's not ideal, but, you know, whatever. Um, what if we just let our tanks go? Do they win? Do they maybe win? Can they do really well here, maybe? Especially if they have support attack and s from other divisions. Oh, we got some subs up here, which really sucks, but whatever. Um, we did a general attack in a little bit as well. But, yeah, overall, not bad. I made these tank divisions a little different. We've got quite a few comms to go through as well. It's always nice. And these are infantry guys, I think. So, if there's one, uh, in terms of comments, is... Uh, I think they inert the plague due to multiplayer balance. It is it's either that or it takes hundred days to kick in. Someone else says, "Ooh, and actually, probably maybe we'll stop attacking and just concentrate our forces again." How about we stop for now? Uh, let's see. Someone says, "I find that when a member of the River Coalition <clears throat> starts an offensive war, the rest of the nations, uh, member nations, are very hesitant to actually join it. Occasionally, not even joining it at all. Becoming the empire is pretty much the best way of beating the co coalition as well." I even go as far, so far as to say it's probably mandatory. So, like, how we became the Griffonian Empire as well. Oh, they're actually really pushing us hard here, huh? Kind of sucks. Um, we might need to send our tanks south, but we'll see after we do this. Nice. Let's see what we can do. You guys go in there, too. As well. Nice. Do the best you can for now. And they are re... Oh, well, that's not good. Oh, that's really not good. So, if that's the case, if they want to go that way, we got to start pushing out this way, then. Because it's going to be either our manpower or their manpower drains first. And we have way more than they do, so. It's going to be their manpower then. Go. See what you can do. Because this is really bad. I forgot about this whole front. My bad. Is this my stuff? Cool. Get some more refuel because we're definitely, 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 definitely going to need it. Yeah, I completely forgot about that. And we're using some motorized as well. Which is very nice. Oh, good god. Oh, good god. They actually brought out their navy. Uh, strategic bombing. Ace priority. Yes, please. Now the comment says, I suppose you're intended to immediately start justifying and eating the small powers around you. I guess it makes sense. Someone also says, in TNO, can you do the Kemerovo with Prince Yuri as successor path? Probably can. Yeah, probably can. Uh, that's a lot of divisions there. No wonder we can't win right there just yet. Losses. Um, let's see. We've lost so far 163,000, but we've destroyed about 600,000. So, overall, they're going to be running out of division or manpower before we do, which is incredibly important. We are literally going to bleed them dry as much as possible. And we should have... We actually do have air superiority. I mean, look at look at our air force. Look at that. Enemy logistics bombed. Nice. 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 Once we seriously start capitulating some people, then it, it'll get even easier and e Oh, yeah, there you go. Exactly. It'll get easier and easier and easier and easier. <clears throat> Not to go to just destroy as much manpower as possible. So they cannot recover. Look at that. It's dropping like crazy. Of course, ours is dropping like crazy too. Don't get me wrong. But still. Uh, keep going. Ooh, did we get... Ooh, we just lost a division down there. That sucks. Hey! You destroy our divisions, we destroy you. So here... I'm going to actually send you guys over here. Naval even though we're not really using them. It is what it is. And over here, what else? Oh, it's all down here. Alright. A couple of more tank divisions. What is going on down here? Bro. <coughs> Excuse me, but bro. Wow, we lost a lot of subs. They're sending the, in their entire fleet. Ooh, that's not good. Well, we just lost our entire fleet. Of course, this is a fleet that we've been... Not really been using very much, but still. Oh, we can still get another one too? Nice. Yeah. You guys should probably push out. Do the best you can. So we've lost 800,000. They must have lost over a million, 1.2 million, which is good. They're out of manpower. So any damage we do, they cannot recover. We have enough that we'll be fine for now. We can go up to all adult serve anyway, so. So in theory, it should get a little easier here. 
bleed them dry. Of course, the more territory we do take, uh, the more uh, map I will need for garrisons as well, so you do want to keep that in mind. The Empire is not even close to capitulating, but they've lost they've lost enough at this point that they can't really do too much against us. Right, Herman. Preferred tactic is what? Unexpected thrust. Go that one too, because you can. Let's go with overwhelming fire. You get delay, maybe overwhelming fire. Oh, wow! Go, tanks, go. Jeez Louise, man. It's a lot of divisions being destroyed, so. Um. And then not everyone needs a blitz one. We'll still use it. Nice. You guys are both linked up on the same side here. We lost over a million as well. We're quickly catching up in casualties, but... We're quickly uh, taking over the entire nation, so... We're gonna need time to mobilize more, more adults, all adults there, and stuff like that, so... I think part of the reason why we're not doing so great sometimes is just because we don't have enough supply. These guys shoot, they're out of map already anyway, so. And this is a good way to do it? Not really. It's kind of a dumb way to take them out like this, but still. Oh, why can't we win here? We should have air superiority. We should have absolute air superiority here. No, we're going to win eventually. Beam Claw. I think they're doing great so far. I was complaining about them so much last episode, and I probably will still complain about them in this episode. Uh, actually, don't even do that. The quell's not really ready to be taken out yet, which is fine. What's going on up here? Not much. Good. Yeah, Carthaginian Empire. We've got nothing. Now we've got nothing too. Yeah, well, this is kind of ridiculous. Having to mobilize the entire, literally the entire nation for taking out this entire faction too. But you know, whatever. Take them out. Hey, they all died. Look at that. Go figure. Hey, Griffin Stone's gone. Just millions upon millions of dead. Nabuzia too has to die as well. And that's kind of why we went to war to do this as well. Come on, get the Grifton. Nice. There we go. Firefighting drills will be good. We could really use those actually right now. Uh, too. A little ahead of time, but I don't care. Good job, tanks. Drastically. Different from what I said last episode, but whatever. Ooh, I should have double checked and used the. Uh... Oh, my bad. Mm. Use that one still. Some of these guys are almost literally dead themselves, but it looks like you just got an upgrade. Skilled staffer, very nice. There they go. Can we do settlers thing? Yeah, bring settlers. We'll bring more settlers. Even more dead. Good. Look at that. Beautiful. 
Love it. No, if they want to do that, so be it. We'll send you out over here. Lost about, you know, maybe roughly two and a half million. By the time we're done here, they'll, they'll all be dead. They'll literally all be dead. Look up here. They'll all be dead. More subs? Yes, please. All of Carthen? Oh, you betcha. Look at all these guys. Dead men, dead ponies already just hanging out. Or dead griffins, maybe. Come on, I want help out there. Oh, they took that. Well, there you go. They got Scathidian Empire. Did you to this next? No, Protector of New Maryland. Ah, that makes sense. Wow, that's really strong. No, these guys are okay. We will need more. Wow. That's what they deserve. We got them. Just like how I got this cup of coffee here. Wait, what? Why would we want to satellite these guys? Now they have no one to hide behind. Bring you more settlers. Nice. Well. Sure, guys. Sure. Wow. Supply's probably not very good here, though. Ah, beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. They thought they could do well against us, but uh, they kind of didn't. Who would have thunk it? Cool. Nice. I'll just need that for that part. Anything there? Well, I'll use the tanks down here too. And we'll probably keep going to war with more people. And here we are now at war with, ooh, very laggy, um, Noskasa as well as the Soviet Socialist Republics of Hirojenma. And of course we have our convoys, convoy destroyers here having a good old time. Just just kind of raiding. Just hanging out, raiding, um, and having a jolly good time. But at the same time, we can become or proclaim the Oscrophonian Empire. Which is very nice. But we probably want to start just flying on these guys too, right? First 10 days, not bad, not bad. Led by Kedar Sklerit. Sklerit. So be it. Ah, I'm gonna proclaim it. Oh, we look at that. Beautiful. Losses? A lot of losses. Quite a few from us, but quite a few from them as well. And we won! All right, and which up next? I'll probably just, like go to war with uh, maybe some of these guys. We'll naval invade right now. The goal is to naval invade here. I'm not sure how well we can do. We'll see. We'll do the best we can. 
And we'll try to annex our puppet as well. Little puppet. Mind your ores and stuff like that? Sure, why not? Not sure how strong these guys are, but we'll see. A lot of manpower. Quite a few divisions. They're already sinking some of our ships, which is not ideal. And then we'll throw in, like, we got a lot of fighters now, which is awesome. And some casts. See what you can do. You want to attack and destroy our subs? We'll come and attack and uh, navally destroy uh, your ships using our uh, planes. That's how it works. Look at that. Good. Sink them all. Ooh, we lost sub. That sucks. But we just sunk their part of the fleet. A Makawian style battleship, huh? Nice. Oh, wow. Look at all that they lost. Oh! Look at us. Oscar Fornian Empire. Adela, good job so far. So we need this so that we can come down here and actually grab this. The Ostgryphonian Empire. What a beautiful thing. Oh, wow. Hold on. So we got way more manpower now. So this is all the com uh, compliance. No, this is compliance. This is resistance. Wow. Do we core more stuff, I, I suppose? Hopefully we can. Yeah. Hopefully we can eventually, but... Look at all that manpower. Oh. Beautiful. You will lose a couple of subs here and there, but... Hey, two destroy destroyers and another battleship? Because we are making ships like crazy now. Fast battleship sunk. Nice. Nice. Now, I don't know how well we can navally invade, to be honest with you. We'll try our best. But, you know, no guarantees, of course. What do you try to force the attack? Could you actually win there? Yeah, you could. Very good. Can they actually pierce us? No, they can't, which is good. Oh, you actually won there. Look at that. Nice. Beautiful. I want you two. But one go right there, and the other one guy just kind of go that way. Nice. Ooh, you don't want to lose that tile, but we're still doing okay-ish, for now-ish. Nice. Nice. But still. Good. Keep the pressure up. All I want is just one stupid port. Ah, the person in the defense now, huh? I'm very surprised that we haven't done very much else. He's probably promoted very good, and they all died. That's the way we like it. Them all dying. And now they're completely cut off, and they're gonna die. Hey! Not bad at all. And as you can see, everybody, we've gone ahead and, well, dropped our 15 tank divisions up here, but, um, hopefully they don't die over there. But we've already invaded Stalingrad, and I've gone to war with the Changing Lands, and they're killing each other. So basically now it's three -way, three way war, so. Uh, let's see, they have some manpower, and they have no manpower, which is good. They've got a lot of divisions, and they've got not as many, so Stalingrad is probably going to die first. We have one army already over here, and they're, they're doing okay. They're doing alright. Casualties so far, not bad. Not great. But the changings are definitely going to give us a run for our money, so... <clears throat> we best be prepared. Even though we're looking pretty good on manpower ourselves currently, so... I'm not super concerned about that, but... We'll see. Oh, Nova Griffonian Protector's gone, huh? All right, all 15 tank divisions made it out of there, which is very, very good. More military police, maintenance companies, engineers. Oh, nice. Very good. Ooh, supplies are not looking too good around here. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Lots and lots of things are not looking too good around here, but that's all right. We'll get things squared away as much and as fast as we possibly can. Take as much territory as possible, and tanks have already made it down here, which is not bad. But, yeah, there's going to be definitely Struggle Ball City. Uh, not great, but we can't win. 
And why can't we win? Because we don't have air superiority. Because AI has the airfields. And we have none. So that's why we're struggling over here quite a bit. That's literally the only reason why. But hopefully we can build some air bases up, build some more supply. Did you just counter invade us? Oh, they're from over here. Makes sense. Go, 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 Inspector Gadget. Sinking subs, which is nice. Galaxies are probably pretty high for us, but we're already doing precision bombing. We could do tactical strikes, but it makes more sense for us to do uh, strike craft primacy. So. Come on, man. Let us shoot down these goddamn planes. <sighs> so annoying. Sending the convoy raiders here. We've lost actually a lot of ships by doing this. But it's worth it. There you go. Don't give him room to move. Nice. And we almost have them. Oh, there we go. Use it. Oh, did I do the wrong one? Maybe. Are we doing changelings? No, we're not. We should probably do those guys, too. Nice. There you go. Pinglin is gone. The fall of the pings. Ah, now we're doing better down here, which is good. Oh, you guys, we don't really have the supply for this. We honestly don't really have the supply for this, which sucks. Good job, guys. Good job. God dang it. Well, we just don't have supply. Now we have more air superiority over here, obviously, just because they don't have any planes, but still. They have basically no manpower either, so. <coughs> it does look like they are hurting a little bit, at least, which is good. Um, so trying to put in a lot of resistance. Stalin has fallen? No. I'd kind of be surprised if they were to immediately, or that quickly at the very least. Go here to there. No, here. Come, game. Oh my god. What the heck? Then go around. If possible. No, they just threw a bunch of divisions in there, of course. A lot more of the real guns are showing up, which is nice. Yeah, they're just doing a ton of air damage to us because we don't have air superiority. Which is so dumb. There goes our country. So dumb. I don't get us wrong, we should be shooting down tons and tons and tons and tons and tons of enemy planes, because, uh... Well, we shot down a lot of them already. Zavropon? There we go. I'm taking everything. I don't really care what the enemies say. They think it's their territory, but in all honesty, it's ours. Oh, I was going to take a while to do so. I apologize for the clicking, but it is what it is. And we're almost there, and here we will go. Nice. You and me, buddy. You and me. So you guys. Look at this. Very short, concentrated attack line through here. Come on, just kill them off. They do not have air superiority. Do they not realize how, like, literally how many millions of men we have in the air? And we've lost probably hundreds of thousands. We've been killing a lot of them off. Killing off a lot of our own manpower too, but still. Ah, no, they have plenty of manpower because these guys are here. I kept looking at the Manhattan probably. Fine to do for now. Armor. 
Everyone's in armor specials apparently. Make it kind of awkward for us, whatever. Yeah, their net map art, I, I understand why it's not being depleted that fast. It literally makes no sense. What? Now we better be already down here. I mean, that's ridiculous. Look at that. You can try to keep doing that. How are we losing so many men? Are these air superiority hoons? Ah, now they're even more, 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 more. Overall, it does look like we're doing really well against them, though. Generally, well against them. More Rika, maybe? Alright. More ground support? Yes, please. Unlimited ground support? Yes, please. Nice. Cut them off. Finally. Some sort of encirclement. Almost 100,000 losses. Good. Kill them all off. They're slowly running out of manpower. We got over 5 million left. You guys have nothing. And changing Alenia is eh, probably slowly losing stuff too. Can they not go in? They should be able to go in. Hello? This is stupid. This is stupid. How? How can they not go in? Well, that's made very poorly then, if they can't go in. Are you telling me after the Lunas set up a naval invasion to invade? That's stupid. <clears throat> In the meantime, the infantry are doing quite well. Probably we're actually doing more than what was happening here. What the? Ah, that's fine. Over there, that's fine, whatever. Anything over here? Go with that one for now. Try to nail the invade, but. No guarantees for success. And lots of radar. All over the flipping place. Nice. Get up there, get up there, go, 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 go. Oh, so now I can go that direction? So stupid. They're done. Just like we do with the Carthaginian Empire earlier. Eh, there's not much else I can do about that. Nice, there we go. Finally. Surround and exterminate. With extreme prejudice. Because if you're not being prejudiced, you're not being cool. Rename Stalingrad. To prin Princessin. Princessin. Caramel Marks to Laudemir. Allytown gets its original name back. Nice. Very nice. Good job, you ding dongs. Probably take off some of these now, too. And what is this one? Aerial wave? Why not? 
Very costly wards we have here. Hello. Very costly, but it's extraordinarily costly for these guys, because we got to go all the way across the continent. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. But having that radar is going to help out so much. Oh, they're, 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 they're done. They're pretty much done. Nice. Yeah, the couch is so sharp, just ramping up. Oh, we forgot about this. Go dig in. Uh, start letting these. There. Green Hubbard. There you go. How much more do we need to annex them? Uh, not much more. Ooh, we lost a sub. Yeah, we should be. We have like a really good amount of screen penetration now, so they're going to sink some subs by the same time. Should be able to sink some of their stuff too. Lone wolf would not be bad. The only dr low drilling master just shooting the crap out of as many torpedoes as possible. We lost probably a lot of ships here and there. It's fine. Whatever. How do they have air superiority? But then, like, we come over here, but we have no, like, no planes, no air bases. I don't understand that. That's a lot of damage, though. That's a lot of damage. Oh, I have basic armor cards as well. Because for garrisons, we'd like to throw that on there, too. Mobile warfare, mobiles, truck drawn artillery stuff. Nice. A lot of suppression. I don't understand why there's still not a mass assign button. Like, Paradox would be like, okay, just want to mass assign all these infantry battalions or armored car battalions uh, to make it really easy. Should be a mod for that, too. I say Paradox because they kind of own this. Armored chars. And more armored chars, and then armored treasure going up. Now that's a lot of suppression. That should save us a slight amount of manpower. Slight amount. Not much. But a slight amount. Oh god, yeah. Supplies are going to be so bad down here. Nice. Yeah, we're doing really well now. They have less than 136 divisions, so... Recount 6, happy 2023. Bring in the settlers. Nice, look at all that stuff. Even the Air Force in defense. Pretty darn intense. Also, I don't think I showed you the template. I haven't tried 41, 41 combos. So we have armored cars. We, oh, no, no. We have uh, medium tanks, which I need to get more medium tanks. We have mechanized and one thing of motorized artillery. And between 41 and 45, I hear it's a pretty good division template as well, so. Hey, what is this? Combined support? Oh, yes, please. Even more granite, granite attack? Oh, yeah. Bomb those a little. Ding dong ring nose. I got those people to capitulate already. Beautiful. Beautiful. Look at all that. Oh, look at all that. Finally, we got green air. Now, it's not my fault that we didn't have enough green air. I knew that we needed more air bases. And we eventually got there, but Jesus. That took one so long to get. Gather prey. Goodbye, sir. Las Pegasus. Ah, I fell to one nation before, but now it's going to fall to an even superior nation under Edla von Wingenberg. I was born 19th of December 1974. Less than 100 divisions left. Or about so. We're missing anything? Uh. Not really. Guns, that, they've hit the negative counter, so. Ooh, it looks like we have quite a bit of red up here, too. That's not ideal. Probably, yeah. Don't 
But as long as the southern front does really well, that'll be that's all that really matters right now. Because these guys will be taken out soon enough. These guys will be taken out. There's not really much they can do, especially since we're going to be surrounding the entire thing. to give them supplies, eh? No, I don't know about that. Quite laggy now, though. Only have 12,000 convoys. That's all. Slow going because it's very, very laggy. <clears throat> ah. Good. Just had to get more political power. Just a little more pee pee. Another infantry division sounds very good to us as well. Wait, why do we get another infantry division? I don't think we made, we made those, but okay. Ooh, you guys got encircled. That's not good. Van Hoover? Goodbye, sirs. Changing millennia still. They have no divisions and up to four divisions left. Alright, what's this one? Ample Spectrum Operations. Nice. I've never actually completed this before. It's pretty hard to be doing. Nice, too. They're still holding out here for some reason, somehow. Somehow, some way. We'll get them done. Oh, uh, looking pretty nice over here. Oh, and we're pushing pretty darn far into here. I mean, they pretty much are out of divisions at this point, so. Not super concerned about it. I wonder how much resistance. How much manpower do we have tied up in resistance? Ooh. Oh, integration. Can we do integration? Siege of Rocks. Holy crap, look at the Dread League. Oh, no garrison, huh? Purification only against Dread League. No garrison. What does purification do? I've never seen that before. Then again, we didn't, we didn't kill them. They were taken up by the Arcturian League, League or Arcturian League, whatever it's called. Vesipolis? Nice. I wish you could, there was a button saying, hey, just leave it on civilian economy, but if there's another option to get, like, integration, well, that'd be great. What else stuff there is? What country we've taken over? I don't know where it is, but whatever. Whatever. I don't like it really matters too much at this point. One moto three. Oh wow, they've really expanded a lot far. They're here. That's good. You guys come back. We only don't really pay attention. This should save supplies quite a bit, but then again, we were quite literally at the capital, so. Hey! There we go. Not bad. Changing Alenia. And then there was one. Oh, I forgot to do this stuff too, huh? Yay, we got him. Sakura? Okay, they're all 
really so close. Oh, well, we did it, my friends. It was pretty challenging in the beginning, but other than that, once they run out of manpower, it's pretty easy to take over a nation. All the men are dead. All the ponies and griffins are dead. Well, I don't think I missed anybody. I might have. But that's kind of a nice thing about taking everyone out late game. Oh, you know Dragon House. Oh, are you flipping kidding me? Um, you know what? Well, let's get to this in just a little bit. And now it's time for a little bit of that there Dragon Adventure. How many? Oh, okay, see how many divisions they have now. Um, not that much manpower. Oh, two to nine. So that's not bad. That's actually pretty good. Well, I guess to the mountain. To the mountain. Very good. And Eastward Islands. Hey, and we got him. Not that bad. Honestly, this is probably one of the best towns I've ever taken out everyone in the world. Now everyone's under the Oscar Foyne Empire and everyone's super happy and there's nothing bad happening at all. But, you know what? I think that's pretty much it for us. Um, uh, everyone's dead. And we're all the better for it. Now, it's been a lot of fun. I like this campaign. It's been a lot of fun. I hope you enjoyed it, too. If you did, leave a like. Subscribe if you are new here. Check out my Discord link in the description below if you haven't already. Let me know what your thoughts on this campaign were, and I will see you tomorrow in another campaign. Thanks for watching. Have a great Oscar Empire rest of your day.